Abo kabe gabais wa wal kaba. Abai abam gabo abing tabu tabi chabo hawa tabu spabik aben abo babe dabo babi. Okay, guys, welcome. Today, I'm going to teach you how to speak in Abu Dhabi. So, this video is a little silly, it's fun, but I hope you love it. Um, when I was a kid, there was a show called Zoom on television, and they did a little bit of everything. They had skits, and it was just a group of kids, and they did skits, and they would do like little cooking things, and they would have science projects and it was just a kind of a variety show for kids and it was a lot of fun and one of their things was they created their own language and it was called Abu Dhabi and basically the way you spoke it was you added an ub before every vowel in a word and so you could turn any word into Abu Dhabi. So if I was going to say dog it would be dubog or if I was going to say cat it would be kabat. And that's just kind of the technique that you would use and you could literally change any word, any sentence, any phrase, any song into Abu Dhabi. So essentially it was creating your own language because if you get good enough and you speak it fast enough, people who don't know Abu Dhabi won't be able to understand it. And that's the fun part is it's not really <laughs> meant to be rude, but like when you teach it to your friends, you can go out in public and you can just be silly and speak your own language together and I had a lot of fun with it when I was a kid and I just wanted to teach you guys how to speak it so you can teach your friends how to speak Abu Dhabi. Okay so I'm gonna say something for you guys and I'll put the wording down below so you can read it. Uh, let's say I'm going to say I'm going to the grocery store to get some bread and eggs. My dog is lazy. I love YouTube. I love of Yabu Tabu. So what you do is you add ab before every vowel and except for the silent vowels so for instance like a bike you only hear the i and not the e on the end so it would be a bike and let me give you another example like like it would be la bike base ba base and ball ba ball or two vowel words like pizza so really honestly this just takes lots of practice when you get the main parts down some words are really hard um, but some are I mean a lot of them are pretty easy and cut and dry and the thing to remember is you want to accent the ub you don't want to accent the vowel so if it was dog you would say dubog, not dubog. If it was cat, you would say kabat, not kabat, and so forth. Um, so just have fun with it. Teach your friends and your siblings, and don't teach your parents, because <laughs> then they'll know what you're saying. No, it's so much fun, and I hope you guys have as much fun with it as I did. And actually, I learned how to speak it playing go fish with my sister and so because it was just simple words and so I'd say dabu yabu habav abe blabu fabish do you have a blue fish and she would say nubbo then I would say gabo fabish and we just learned that way and then I just started incorporating it into everyday sentences and you can amaze your other classmates who don't know Abu Dhabi and your friends will know your own personal language and it's just gonna be a lot of fun. Yeah, like I said, it's kind of a silly video, but fun and I hope you guys enjoy it. it comes from my childhood and so I wanted to share it with you guys. Hope you have a good day. Abu Dhabi.
I'll then, uh, <laughs> see, I almost started speaking it because I don't even think about it. And I will see you when I see you. Abinabai waba sabi yabu, wabinabai sabi yabu. Goodbye. Goodbye.